Yo guys, what's going on? Rob at 421 Media House coming at you. I just got home from work. I got this package in the mail. Uh, I got home about 20 minutes ago. It's 3.30 right now. I'm going to crack this open for you guys. I'm going to do a quick uh, quick little first impression. I'm in the middle of trying to get my Squarespace website up and running. Check these bad boys out. Entry O2s. Got 12 of them. I got a brick. Let's crack these open and give you guys a first impression. Um, hopefully this doesn't turn into a five minute video of me fighting with cellophane. Uh, like I said, I'm trying to get my web space, my website up and running right now. So, there we go, the O2s. I got the O1s right here. Boom, boom, complete complex collection so far. I am gonna be doing a review on the O1s at some point in time. I think the O2s are gonna come out a little bit sooner. Um, here we go. So I don't know if you guys know this or not, but I'll show you this really quickly with the entry 01s. This is actually one of my favorite features of this deck of cards. Uh, where, is, where is it? You get these ad cards. That, there's four of them, so they kind of replace the jokers with these, as well as the ad cards. One says four big fans. Um, handle without care. You're better off without me. And then there's a fourth one that has a date on it. And I don't know. Oh, there it is fourth card with the date on it that was the date that the o1s were released it's so back to the o2s quickly it says a deck of cards by entry and signed down here in collaboration with cardistry con entries can creating playing cards for the modern day cardist as cardistry grows as an art form there needs um there's a need for playing cards for both beautiful in design and handle perfectly. These entries created these playing cards. I'll let you guys read that if you want to. Unlike other companies, products range different or attention solely to one place. The best back in cardistry. So looks like those are my two ad cards. Quick run through the face cards. These are very standard faces. That ace actually is pretty cool. Uh, standard royalty. No special, It's a. I guess it's a little bit more of an orange color on the diamonds there, but pretty standard diamond faces. Again, this is just a first impression. I haven't really, I, you guys saw me, I just opened the box. Uh, I will have a full deck review of these guys out next week, but this is just a kind of first impression to show you guys. These are the hearts. Um, Suicide King, like I said, these are just standard faces, nothing too crazy here. Uh, again, that Handle Without Care card, and then here's a date card. That's kind of a neat one. 7, 0, 4, 0, 1, 0, 8, 0, 5, 0, 2, 0, 9, 0, 6, 0, 3. I don't actually know what that date is. Um, so, unless this is just a card to commemorate that they, the 0, 1, the 0, 2, the 0, 3, 0, 4, 0, 5, 0, 6, 0, 7, 0, 8, 0, 9 uh, entries. Honestly, I'm not a huge fan of this back design. I think that this was a bit of a cop-out from them. Um, this is the same back design and just they added a border that you saw from Cardistry Con 2017 they recycled that deck I believe this is printed on a USPCC premium stock that's what it feels like kind of initial initial handling for me I believe I'm going to take a guess here and say these are traditionally cut but I'm not 100% sure let's ferrule these up quickly they are traditionally cut look at that um they do handle quite well. They handle almost exactly like the entry uh, entry ones do. Like I said, I'm not. I'm personally not a big fan of this back design. One other thing that I will say about the O2s is I think they came out a little bit too soon, too close to the O1s. Uh, I don't like that kind of short, week long time span. Um, anyway, kind of a, a one other thing before I let you guys go here. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. Uh, like I said, I do have a couple of decks of Polaris. I'm going to be putting those on my online store that I'm putting together right now. Uh, and I also have a couple of decks left of the Bicycle Blackbeards that I'm going to be throwing in the online store. Uh, I might be doing a giveaway with these, so stay tuned. Uh, I do, uh, I do want to do a giveaway. I'm just trying to piece some things together. Um, one thing that I will say that I would be interested in doing a giveaway for is because right now I am in the middle of trying to like piece together content. Like I said, I got 12 decks of entry O2s. If you guys are interested in those even, let me know. Maybe we'll do a giveaway with the O2s. Um, but what I'm going to say is make sure you're subscribed here. And if you guys have any ideas for content, because you know how I do these crazy pictures where 
Um, you know, I froze the, the phantoms in ice and stuff like that. So if you guys got any ideas for content, let me know and I'll try to make that happen. If I pick one of your ideas, leave a comment below with that idea. If I pick one of your ideas for making videos or making pictures for the week, I will be sure to send you a deck of cards uh, for whatever I feature that with. So if you guys come up with a cool idea for the entry 02s, for example, and you want that deck of cards, be sure to leave a comment below with what I'm what you would like to see for that deck feature and I'll be sure to give away, send you a deck of cards. Like I said, I got 12... 12 decks, one of them is mine, obviously. The rest of them, up for the grabs. I'm going to throw them in my online store when I get that running, so stay tuned for that, and we'll see you guys next week. Um, tomorrow, I do have a podcast dropping. It is with uh, John Horan, the Director of Photography. Probably one of the coolest podcasts I've recorded to date, so be sure to check that out. Uh, next week, I've got Bob Matthews, who I've claimed to be the most interesting man in the world, so be sure to check that one out. I do talk magic with both of them. Uh, John is a director of photography, so he gets us behind the scenes in Hollywood, which is pretty freaking dope. So be sure to check that, that one out, you guys. Uh, anyway, we'll see you guys next week. Have a good one.